but you had me from the start. Hello and welcome to the Simplicity Lifestyle channel. My name is Psyche and today we are talking about anything and everything. I'm just going to turn on the camera and I'm just going to talk and see where it leads me to. Uh, what can we talk about first? Well, I read on the news today and from the 4th of July, it's been reported that hairdressers and restaurants and pubs can now open their doors. Everybody's saying everybody's so happy about that. We gently get back to being together, but actually talking to one another. Because when you're in a club, you don't really talk. You just go to be dressed up and to try and kind of pull. You know what I mean? You kind of get the guy, get the girl, get the girl and the guy, or whatever it is you're going to get. This way, it kind of makes people sit down, have a chat, talk about everything that's been going on, sharing opinions, having our mini arguments and our fallouts. But We've got companionship and people are not so much alone anymore. And that's a really good thing. And I'll tell you something, if I had money, I would be buying a property now and turning it into a pub. I think that's one of the things that we should really have not got rid of, our pubs. Because pubs are a really good place to like sit around and have a nice time with. And you don't have to go and drink alcohol. It's just like a beautiful social club especially when the decor is nice and people don't smoke in there anymore so it's not like <coughs> when you're trying to have a conversation and you know your hair comes out stinking it's not like that anymore it's just nice and pleasant and decent and especially now we're hitting summer i'm telling you something those those pubs are going to be making some serious money is don't let what happened to the toilet paper and the drinks run out breweries make sure you've got all your ducks in order and make sure you've got the drinks on tap alcoholic or non-alcoholic alcoholic make sure you have them in stock because people will be flocking to your places whether they're at home, in their own counties, whether they drive to Brighton or any of these lovely seaside resorts in the United Kingdom. Because let's face it, most holidays are shut down. So you're not gonna get on a plane and you're not gonna be flying anywhere. And people who did book to fly somewhere, they would have canceled it and pushed it back to next year. So you can say that 80% of the people will be staying in the country this year and they will be looking to go and further afield within their own country, which is a good thing because we need to, you know, buy and spend in our own land before we do it in someone else's. And it's a good thing because then we can start looking at places to go and things to do. And in doing so, again, pubs and restaurants and stuff, please make sure that you are really stocked up because we don't want it like the, the, the toilet paper debacle where you can even get toilet paper and think, how are you going to clean your... You know what I mean? Hairdressers. Oh my goodness. People are so happy about the hairdressers because I have seen some serious, serious sights out there. It was almost as if we're going back to the Neanderthal days and the eight days where there was hair everywhere. Woo! Back to the 70s. Yeah, man. But they're going to be tamed again. We're going to be groomed again. Ooh, but that's only hair in your head. Can you imagine all those beauty parlors are still closed and all those people who need to get their Hollywoods done and their God knows what done and their mm -mm done. That must be really suffering. Anyway, without much further ado, we swiftly move on. Uh, what else has been happening? Uh, something came out about Trump, but we'll pass on that because we're not going to be political. To be honest, I really like doing this YouTube channel. You see this person, it's taken 24 years. And just like Samuel Jackson, one day I woke up and everything fell into place. But YouTube, it's all welcome. And, um, yeah, I really, really love it. I absolutely love it. I'm doing everything myself, my makeup, my hair, everything. So I am going to be doing um, some programs on makeup, but I'm gonna get some friends in who are in the makeup industry to come and do it whilst we have our chat. 
Um, so yeah, that would be really good. And I'll be doing some fashion things as well because you know I'm in the fashion business. I have my own little company, Psyche Inc. It's tiny, 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 tiny. But again, I'm so proud because I'm working for myself. It's very, very difficult and, and you know, lots of hard work. If you don't work, you don't get paid. When you're sick, it's even worse. Um, but you know what? I really believe that karma has helped out because when you work hard, as I said before, you might not get everything you want, but you get everything you need. And somehow I really believe that when you really dig in and work hard, the universe works with you. I will always believe in that. Nobody will tell me different. I call it the universe, but you might call it Allah, you might call it God, you might say, I don't believe in any God at all. Anyway, I'm gonna leave it there for now. I'm gonna see how this has come out. Hopefully it's come out okay. This is the new normal. We should be better people. We should be learning from everything that's been happening in the world about us. Whether you are for or against it, it still makes everyone have to think about it. And in thinking about it, we can actually stop pointing the fingers, fingers outwardly and start pointing the fingers inwardly to check ourselves. Okay, thank you so much for watching. Have a lovely afternoon. Adios, bye.